We'll rewind to last year in the Walker Hackensack Akeley baseball team won 21 games before falling just one shy of state. Even after losing some key guys from that roster, this Wolves team is more than ready to take the next step. Anytime a team has to replace five senior all-conference players, that usually poses some questions. But for the Walker Hackensack Akeley baseball team, well, they've had the answers. A 14-1 record and ranked number seven in class single A. Coach Lean and Coach Gavin, are, they just do the same thing every year and it seems to be working so I uh, try to fix something that's not broken. Their method, score a lot of runs, play solid defense, and get strong outings on the mound. It's really big having three seniors as your main pitchers uh, because they, they don't get overwhelmed in games. Uh, they know what to do when it comes like down in the moment. Kevin Smith, Jack Noggle, and Phil Kangas are the three senior leaders that sit two through four in the lineup in the top three spots in the rotation. Our ace is Kevin, and so Phil and I just do our best to uh, fill our roles and make sure nothing bad happens after uh, Kevin comes out of the game and we come in. We've had some really good games from all three of them, and I think all three of them are pitching the leader. Um, so it, it, that's pretty amazing for high school baseball. Only 31 runs surrendered by this rotation this season, a little over two a game, but this team also gets it done at the plate, leading the state in runs. Top five hitters we have have really, really, you know, hit the ball really well. I think the, the bottom four guys are, they're young kids, but they've had some really big at bats for us all year long. And the guy who leads this team off and sets the tone at the top was in Arizona last season. And I've moved here and they've all just made me feel like I've been here the whole time. Most of them tell me they forget that I ever even moved here. <laughs> like I've been with them all year and it's been my whole life. Junior Edgar Fike Anderson has slid right in at third base and been a huge addition to this roster. She made a play um, last week that I, I haven't seen a high school kid make in a long, long time. So he, he's been a welcome addition. He leads off, gets on base, steal bases, and he's been he, he's had a solid year. So with a mixture of senior leadership, youngsters, and even newcomers, the Wolves look to avenge last year's section final loss and reach their goal to state. It'd be absolutely amazing to step in with these guys and, and go that far. I mean, we're, we're a family already, so I'd, I think if that would happen, it'd be sort of a dream come true. The Wolves are currently on a 10-game winning streak and have already captured the Northland Conference crown. They finish up their regular season Tuesday night against Pequot Lake. Still a cool story, though, losing all those all-conference players last year, and it doesn't, didn't seem like they missed them at all. So, If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.